Welcome back, this is Yama Jack, and today we got Gunslinger, Hellmark Station, Suicidal. <clears throat> and I got water. Uh, and depression. Still depressed. Tonight? Hasn't been much time since the last episode, it hasn't really changed. I, uh, work on the new typing strategy. Use my thumbs to hit the space bar as uh, as a normal person, I suppose. Um, it's going good. I'm starting to type like about 120 fairly consistently, which is what I was kind of hoping for by today. Um, still not very comfortable though. It's still not very comfortable to type like that. Um, so it's gonna it's gonna take some some time to readjust, relearn how to type like this. Get back to where I was before. I'm, uh, I'm hoping I can get back up to, to like 160, 170 ish soonish, you know? As, uh, as like a high, you know? Because that's where I was before, is uh, my like normal sort of good race was about 160, 170. An average race was about 140 to 150, and a bad was like 130 or lower kind of thing. Which is, uh, which is always funny to me. Because I'm in the Discord for the Type Racer, right? And, um... They'll get, like, a 91 words per minute or something like that. And they'll be like, dang, I did so good! And I'm like, yo, I'm, like, happy for you. That's awesome. Like, you did, you did great. You know? Like, genuinely, I, I'm, 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 I'm pleased with them. I, I love seeing people be happy about, uh, typing and stuff like that. Um... So I am, I am genuinely excited for them that they've, uh, that they've, you know, broken their record and and gotten something that they get to feel good about and that they're excited about typing. That's that's a good thing. But then it all, it is always kind of funny, like, you know, when 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 somebody's best race ever that they're like super proud of is worse than like my full tilt. I just can't even type today, <laughs> you know. Like, if I do, like, a 110 or something like that, I'm like, alright, like, something, something's gone terribly wrong. I should just stop typing. I'm, uh, I'm just not really capable of it right now. You know, like, I'm just really tired, really fatigued, you know? The fingers are in excruciating pain or something, you know? Like, that's, like, 110 is, like, or at least before, um, I, uh, I, I switched to the thumb typing, anyway, with the space bars. Um, you know, one, 110 was like a just full tilt, terrible race, and it's, 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 you know, still, at, even at that point, my, the worst I could possibly do in a competitive, in a competitive environment is, uh, is still better than, than like somebody's best, which is, uh, just it always kind of gets a chuckle out of me when I see it, but then, you know, it's not to be rude, I, I do, again, I, I feel genuinely happy that they're excited about it, and, uh, you know, everybody starts somewhere, right? They can't just be good at the start. Can't do that. You gotta, you gotta kind of grow. But uh, I do get a kind of chuckle out of it to myself. Just the, uh, the, 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 the sheer, like the distance between, uh, between me and like the average typist. Just kind of, I don't know why. I just, I find it amusing. Um, at times. But again, I'm, I'm, I'm genuinely happy when, when people are happy about it. And it's not like I'm like, haha, you stupid, you stupid slow typer. Like, no. Like, I, I, th I think they're doing great. They're having fun. That's what matters. I'm happy for them. But I chuckle to myself, you know? It's not like a, a mocking thing. It's it's more at the situation. Um, I kind of, I kind of do the same thing when I, when I see kids do, uh, any kind of an achievement. And then I just think, you know, so it's, it's just it's funny when when people are proud of something that uh, that they've done that that really just doesn't amount to much in the grand scheme of things to to people who are like good at it you know like when uh, when you watch videos of a of a kid who just does a, a soccer goal or something like that that's just not really that impressive but they're super proud of it and they're super happy you're like well wow, that's good you know you did great awesome I'm glad you're having fun you know. But it's still kind of still kind of funny when you like look at how happy they are about it, and then how sad somebody else would be about having done the exact same thing. You know what I mean? Just that difference, kind of. 
I, I, uh, I find it interesting. I find it fascinating. But, uh, I mean, the Discord, the, the, the Type Racer Discord is, is mostly made up of kids anyway. Like, actual, literal kids. You know, it's, it's a lot of 13, 14 year olds kind of thing. Lots of even younger than that, but uh, as soon as they say they're younger than that, they get banned. Because uh, Discord TOS is, is 13 or older. Um, so it is, it is like literal children um, that, that populate the Discord for the most part. And they're, they're pleased that they're typing like a 90 or something like that. And it's like, you know, good for you. That's awesome. Like you're showing some real improvement. That's, that's, that's genuinely really cool. Good for you. Um, but it is, it is kind of funny. At the same time, you know? I think we're going to do a shorter episode today. I said I'd do long, like the full length episodes today. I kind of got my talking of the depression off in the last episode. In this episode, I just kind of want to go to sleep or something, you know? Like, so we're probably just going to do a shorter episode, uh, is my guess. Well, not my guess. I've, I've decided. I've made the decision. I read um, Daughter of the Emperor. It's a Korean webtoon about a girl who is reincarnated into a um, uh, a little girl's body. Like, from when she's born, she's just immediately, like, remembering her past life kind of thing. More so than reincarnated, I guess. Um, and, uh, she grows up, and, and her, her father is, like, this tyrannical emperor. Um, so she grows up with it. It's, it's actually, like, the, the, the plot sounds strange, but it's, it's genuinely really, really, really cute. Um, I read that over the past, like, couple of days, and it was really, it was a good read. Finished it today. And it made me kind of sad. I guess that's another contributor, another little minor thing that, that really doesn't amount to much, but which just kind of... You're just like, aw. You know, a lot of those things add up, and all of a sudden it's, it's a bad day. But I read that. If, you, uh, if you're if you into to manhwa or anything like that, webtoons and stuff like that, um, just, like, I can't recommend it enough. It's so cute. It really, really is. I love it. Um... I think it's coming up on the end. It's not finished, um, but I, I, it feels like we're coming up to to a conclusion reasonably soon. Like in the next, I don't know, maybe 60 to, I don't know, maybe even more than that. Um, like 100-ish chapters. I mean, it's like 210 chapters in. Feels like we're coming up on a conclusion and then kind of like the post-conclusion. Um, you know, just like, let's just continue it for a little while, fill some stuff in, and then kind of, it ends. Um, but it's really, really cute. Um, so, so adorable. I love it. I was having a great time reading it earlier. And then it ended! Why did it have to do that, dude? I look forward to more of it. I wanted to read the web novel, but it doesn't seem to be translated either, so that kind of stunk. Um, yeah, it's good though. If you like it, read it. If you like, if you like web novels and all that kind of stuff, read it. Webtoons, you know, all that. Genuinely like, it for 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 webtoons, it's probably in my top like five. I think it's really really good. Hyper out of like non action web novels. It's probably my favorite. I think. But you know, when when you take into account the action ones, you gotta kinda recognize that there's uh you know, something like solo leveling and um what else would there be? Beginning after the end, I think, personally. Um Thinking, uh, omniscient viewers, omniscient readers' viewpoint, maybe? M might be up there as well. Um, 
A Returner's Magic should be special, I believe is the name of one as well. That one's really good. Go drop a grenade at your feet. Uh... Yeah, and there's, um... There's a, uh... Dungeon Reset is really good as well. Um... The Gamer is really good. You know, those are all up there as well, for sure. Are they better than, uh, than... Daughter of the Emperor? I don't know. But, uh, solo leveling for sure. Beginning after the end, I think, definitely. Uh, and then beyond that, I'm like, I don't know. It's, it's a bit of a tricky situation, which is why I'm saying if it's gonna be taking those into account. I don't think it's necessarily my favorite, but it's definitely in the top five. Definitely in the top five. It's very, very good. Currently, I'm reading uh, some other ones as well. I don't remember the names of them. Um, I'll let you know when, when if it's good. Anyway, I just started it. I'm like part way through the first chapter. Or episode, I guess they're called. I'll let you know. Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Sack it, dude. Destroy him. Get him. Should use that thing more often. It's like actually, like you noted, like I don't know if you noticed, the damage per shot went up like dramatically when I picked this up. It was kind of incredible. Um, but anyway, like I said, we're gonna do a short episode today because I'm depressed, dude. What do you want from me? Um, that's gonna do it. So thanks for watching. Remember to like the video, if you like, subscribe to more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.